Hello and welcome to something new and slightly different. Welcome to Regiments, a game developed by Bird's Eye Games, uh, published by Micropose. We're releasing the 16th of August. The developers have given me a preview key to check the game out and show it a little bit to you. And, you know, give my recommendation and everything. Um, I think we just should just start with something very basic. What the hell is Regiments? It is kind of in the same, th same theater of what War Game has done. And I guess with that, you know, follow up Warno. Um, and um, Steel Division. Uh, it's uh, basically about a fictional World War III in 1989. So basically at the, near the end of the Cold War. And it's, um, you know, West versus East kind of deal and it's more based around regiments and less about deck cards but a lot of this is it's, it's it's different it's unique enough and as far as i can tell i think it's mostly been developed by one guy but i don't know that for sure but i thought i read that somewhere or heard somebody say that this is like mostly developed by a single person so with that in mind it is very impressive and let's just jump into uh the operations now i believe as far as i know these are actually slightly dynamic as they state that um yeah, so you got, yeah, you got the skirmish with dynamic objectives and we've got some campaign here. And I think it might be just fun to jump into the campaign, play that through the entire on YouTube mission and permission. And at the end, just give my honest opinion about it. I've played about, woo, I've did some of the early access. I've kind of got about 72 minutes in, so not a lot, but a little bit over an hour, I guess. Um, did the tutorials, uh, played a single skirmish game, and yeah, I think the only thing I noticed so far is that there is no music in this game, so at least I did not, wasn't able to find any, and I probably am kind of shit at it, so uh, yeah. I think we're just going to start off with this one. And go to battle and see whatever. You even need to rattle the local forces, defeat the four MSD mobile groups, and destroy Rebel Command Network. Okay, so Colonel, we've just received our new orders. The goal of our March West is finally clear. The good news is that rumors about the new war are just that rumors. We're not going to cross the border into West Germany. The bad news is, is that the mass strikes across the country got much worse in its own revolt now. Mostly for fourth mo motorized Schutzen Division as defeat defected from the chain of command. They took positions northwest of Erfurt. Effort, clearing the local Stasi and party presence. The attempts to suppress this news have largely failed and due to example have swayed a lot of those warning, uh, wavering loyalties. They call themselves the force of the Freie Deutsche Republik. Uh, the situation is, is unacceptable and must be immediately resolved before more people fall into this insanity. Their proximity to the critical section of the border presence a grave risk too. Your 16th Panzer Regiment will start the operations right away, even if the rest of our 7th Panzer Division is still stuck in traffic jams <laughs> and unruly crowds. Stau. Uh, really, did the remaining pockets of loyalist forces defeated the mobile groups of the four MSD and strike right into the heart of the rebel enclave? Did it, this discipline and speech, the discipline and speech, should allow you to overcome the superior numbers. The state of the emergency gives you full freedom of action. Spare nothing and destroy the enemy. Well, let's go to battle. We'll leave all settings as is. I think medium must be all right. I did a medium skirmish and I've lost. So yeah. Okay, so this seems to be about three stages. We have stage one is meeting engagement. Then we get stage two, which is an attack. And stage three is also a attack. Um, I have not looked at this before. We have about 150 points of operational integrity. I don't even know what this means. Can be good in other types of points. Just to work as new task was an upgrade existing ones. And I think I can spend this then on extra deployment points. How does this work? Okay, so hold on. I've got oh, we got more potential deployment points. Oh, and I can actually call in another division. I have 150 points. We've got a T55 tank battalion. So we are the East German group then. Hold up. I thought that would be. Oh, this is the point where I don't recognize flags that well. Uh the fact that we have all Russian equipment, that's actually kind of interesting. I thought we would play on the other side. <laughs> we always are, huh? So we got napalm strike in here, artillery smoke in here, and this gets me an HQ unit, which actually bo boosts the effectiveness of all. I don't know if this is a good idea, and we get some more supply, but I think I'm not going to bother with it. We have a... Uh, this is what I thought... Uh, sorry, I need to look a little bit quickly at unit types. I am fairly aware with what this means. So mechanized, heavy mechanized, yeah, infantry, fighting vehicle, APC, because this contains like infantry, this armor, 
Uh, it's reconnaissance. Okay, then we've got artillery, art, um, uh, yeah, self propelled mortar, artillery, rocket, artillery. This is air defense, HQ, combat service. Yes, anti tank, and this is rotary wings. Oh, what is that last one? Yeah, so learn to rate your simplified NATO symbols. Uh, this is reconnaissance. Okay. All oh, right. The, the, the bar here means reconnaissance unit. So AA, we've got a mortar team here. We've got a, we've got some couple of uh, attack helicopters. Oh, these are MIs. And we actually got supply trucks. It's quite neat. We've got T-72s, uh, two squads of uh, mechanized infantry, some anti-air, and these one have recoilless rifle in them. So these are actually also very good against light vehicles. We've got a scout. And two T seventy two squads, which are identical. I think we and we got our new HQ unit and some napalm strike besides our heavy artillery and that kind of stuff. So let's uh, I think go to two events. Uh, operational locks will be empty. Phase one Discord. And every four is the easiest way to new guys. Yeah, okay. And the Freie Deutsches Republik. Okay, so uh, it's having a hard time finding mention. Republic in the neck with a name. Okay, well two events, I guess. Um, and these are the facts, raw and random, ache to be sorted out. Select the event for the next phase. Oh, so this is, this is pretty damn dynamic it, as a campaign. That's really interesting. Uh, a perfectly normal day of slaughter. For the last five minutes, phase lasts five minutes less. Plus 100 supply points, plus some deployment points during this phase. Okay. Aerial tactical aids are twice as cheap or airspace denied. Air tactical aids are not available. Helicopters are more expensive to deploy. Okay. So, select the event for the next phase. So we can choose which one we want. That's kind of interesting. Air power may be either the end toward the end of civilization. I do have a little bit of AA, but these are Shilkas, so they're not that great. They're not like anti-air rockets. These use uh, just guns. Um... Well, the second time I'm trying to do this mission, because apparently uh, some OBS error caused to corrupt the uh, footage quite severely. Received. So uh, let's try this again. Uh, let's send, I want some scouts over here. I want one group of these. I want definitely the mortars, the shield cut, the helicopters, the supply over here. I think I actually did not some of the previous stuff because I had to reset in. And let's get another group of tanks, and we can actually get both the BTRs as well. So we can set the entire army group in, but I don't have my other stuff. So yeah, let's just go and uh, uh, yeah. Put these guys on hold fire. Now I have to. So basically, I have a little bit of a spoiler position because I already know some of what's going to happen. Uh, and some troop placement, but I'll try to not abuse that as much. Uh, our first plan is going to take here uh, 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 Bishop Froda and Charlie Hill 90. From there on, we move to Grow Farm and a facility and maybe cleaning or anything like that. We'll see what we can get. Um, let's see what our scouts can pick up. Let's hope we can get him, keep them a little bit hidden. Uh, we'll shift you can see what their actual vision range is we don't see anything so far um, okay let's move these guys up uh, I'm a little bit worried fast move those over there fast move those over there I'm gonna send these helicopters on a flank let's see if we can get some spotting from up here we might have been actually better off but actually these guys don't really have the largest amount of vision oh there you go that is actually AA. Okay, well, I can tell you now that uh, there is some dynamicness going on, because that wasn't visible last time I need to move these guys back. I didn't see Shuka's last time. Didn't lose a vehicle, so I don't need to fully retreat them. But those Shuka's have been destroyed fully. Uh, that's really interesting. And I'm just gonna engage these directly. And wait for these guys to fully uh, repair and resupply. I want this to unload like uh, behind the enemy. Shit. Maybe a little bit risky, but okay. So we have that thing there. 
want you to start shooting at that once you can. Okay, you guys start unloading on that one. Actually, start supporting this. You can see it. Okay, that's pretty, pretty poor. Okay, but we got these tanks now that can actually... Uh, hold on, we actually have a bit of a problem here. Um... They got these helicopters uh, to... These are BMPs, though. They are not too scary. But still... That's something I want to keep alive there. Um, I actually want these guys to get a little bit closer. Because they captured this rather nicely. Okay, but we... Look at that. We got some stuff coming in from there. And I'm actually going to counter artillery. Um, uh, I don't think I can counter it to read this. is a hill? Zone yes. Capture. Okay. Let's see if I can get these guys a little bit closer. Uh, you go get in there. What a Shuka. Well, that is rather bad for infantry, but I think these are to have the AT, so they should be able to engage this at least. ATRs in the flank, unload the man. Um... Okay, they've been actually firing at the tanks, which is not exactly what I had in mind, but it is probably for the best anyway. We are fighting against other T-55s, so... We're fighting against mostly Russian equipment. Um... Get our own Shuka into the city. That's, we've taken this, so we can actually move it closer. Uh, yeah, let's uh, move these guys over here, because that's artillery just hit, hit, knocking me a little bit too much. Actually, just have you RT that like this. Um, uh, okay, these guys can just go and. Whoop. Like that. Shuka can move over here. The tanks destroy the grove here. I'm kind of assuming that there is more stuff in the grove. Um, so I don't think I can freely take it. But let's just see what we find. A little bit risky when you think about it, but... Yeah, and we're hitting these T-55s, like, up front, right? So it's a little bit of a difficult, uh, strike. But, okay, we'll get the supply into the city as well. These guys are now fully entrenched. So basically, if you leave them long enough into a single position, they're fully entrenched after a while. What the hell is that? It's too far. Okay, so it's just a regular... Okay, um, I think they even unload their infantry, uh, even though, you know, they were tasked to load up. Okay, with that set and done, we can uh, fast move them over here. I'm gonna uh, fast move them in there. Uh, let's just have you strike this. I don't really care that much. This have definitely got some AT capacity. Uh, let's see, speed, morale, accuracy. Yeah, look at that. Recoilless rifles. What they're using. Let's retreat off the hill. We can take that, but I need to, you know, force a, a focus there. Let's uh, unload these guys here. Oh, we're taking a lot more fire than I actually want. Try to use, like, speed and aggression, but uh, so far not really working that much in my favor. Uh, I want you to. Uh, Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Uh, let's retreat these guys out because they're gonna otherwise die. We're gonna unload these lads and fight from the, from the rear. I think the problem is we're hitting, being hit by a anti-vehicle unit right there. Okay, those are destroyed. We need to get those guys destroyed. How are you on ammo? You're 12% of your main ammo. Uh, these guys lost some vehicle. They lost a the vehicle, but they're not completely out of it yet. I am gonna have your artillery this. Um, you guys can just move over here. You've got some ammo remaining. Let's hit, you know, hit that guy just. Um, well, these guys can then uh, go sit in here or dig in. There we go. Heavy suppression coming in. Yeah, they're not happy. Good. That's what we would like to see. Okay, we got some... A oh, we got T-72s in our rear. That's really bad. Um, we got still 20% ammo left. Hit those. 
Let's move to his tanks over here. Fast move over here. Yeah, I lost another tank. I'm gonna actually order to retreat. Uh, problem is, I've got those dipshits in my rear, which is gonna be definitely problematic. Uh, these guys are fully Zone okay. I'm gonna go over there. These guys have 0% ammo left, but if we put them in the resupply zone, and I've got some veterancy up, that's really nice. Okay. Hopefully that will do. They're fully on panic, so they're not, you know, functioning that well anymore. I don't really exactly know how the panic system works. I probably should write that at some point. I think it actually reduces their efficiency if I remember completely. Okay, these guys can stay here for now, even though I would prefer them to, you know, be able to regroup and recuperate, but... I think these guys can actually resupply as long as they are, you know. Fighting. Okay, those guys are retreating. That's good. Um, so far, not that bad. Um, I want to definitely capture Hill 90 because it basically opened up the road to here. But and but I do definitely suspect more shit to be there. Um, yeah, I'm gonna tell these guys to retreat so we can pull them back in later. I do you do get actually get the points back if you retreat? So that's why it's better to retreat and let your units be destroyed fully. I'm gonna use this guy over here. We still have these guys over here. Let's actually put them over there. Oh, they were still resupplying. Let's uh, send them back. I thought they were fully resupplied, but they were Because there was green, but they were just still working on it. Let's wait. These guys are fully up there with your ability. I'm probably gonna send one of these groups uh, up here. Because we're nearly captured that. So we're gonna just take Grove and Farm. And keep, uh, keep the BTR there. We should be okay, I think. Uh, so with that said, let's fast move the guys over there. Let's wait for full ammo resupply. I'm kind of hesitant to uh, send this guy any further forward. Uh, got a red T100 regiment I can send in there. Meteor 70 on attack, which you can see here, is this bit here that's being hit. This is risky because I think we probably should have. Okay, nope, there is there is definitely a unit there. I'm getting a little bit too close, I think. Let's uh, allow these to fire. These are riflemen, so. But that is all. Okay, I can fly these over maybe to uh, hit those reservists. You know, keep some pressure off my uh, own guys. Uh, unload. There's tanks over there. So oh shit, what's that? That's scouting. Not the biggest worry. We can hit the. Uh, let's destroy that first. You know? are destroyed. Uh, stay over there, stay over there. You can actually see nicely how they're fronting, which is kind of neat. Um, basically, with this freed up, I think I can actually send these guys over here. Fast move over there. Uh, you, go back for a resupply. We'll keep the scout over here for now. Actually, let's see if we can move it into the hill, because that should be provided some nice uh, overview of the like, facility here. I definitely don't definitely don't think we can take Naza. We should be really Zone aggressive. Um, oh, that's interesting. Did not suspect a tank core there. They're being hit very well. Like, these PDRs don't have any weapons against them. Either. Just some added, you know. Fire support from helicopters and everything. Okay, slow crawl forward. We'll have the tanks in the rear to provide support. We'll fast move these guys over here. We'll send the tanks and fast move from there so we can actually from here duke into the facility. There you go. So that's what I like to see. Uh, and unload there. You can already go. You are fine. You're without ammo, so resupply. After this resupply, we'll set up the entire group uh, further north. The mortar teams can already fast move over here to the zone. 
they should unload the moment they arrive here. Theory. Yeah, okay, they did. That's gonna be. Uh, I do know that I want that to be hit immediately. You know, I have heavier tools. So let's just blast them. You know, no reason to lose units over nothing. Actually, oh, we still have the scout unit over there. I completely forgot about that. Have to hit them on the side as well. Uh, the copper's at seventy-eight percent. Okay, let's uh, move this. Hold fire. There we go, these are back up and running. PTR group, let's move the helicopters over here. On the side. Tanks can just keep moving. Alright, uh, fast move over here. You guys can move over here. You guys can just keep that busy. Yeah, tanks can fire on the move, so that is pretty nice. Probably reduce accuracy or something along those lines. Another, you know, There we go, there we go. You guys can just engage that. Uh, you guys can fast forward all over here. You are not necessarily seeing anything. Okay, these guys are taking some damage, but because they're very close. Let's just reduce that. Can I see? No, I just see one more. Don't, oh, yeah, I don't want to get too close to, to that. Let's see, maybe if I go from here. These guys are panicking, that probably means they're gonna take a large amount of damage. They're taking the farm. If that is their resupply point, I want this group over here looking that direction. Okay, chopper is down, we're gonna retreat him fully because these are very skilled right now and I definitely don't want to lose them. If these guys over here load you up, uh, this group can actually move already over there. Supply, I want you to move over there as well. Yeah, because there's still stuff in the facility. And we probably can capture that. Uh, if I move... I have six minutes remaining. I might be able to take all of them. You know, we've been 20 minutes. We've taken one, two, three, four, five of them. It's just that, you know, resupplying right now is going to take a little bit longer. Zone uh, captured. All right, farm has been captured. Good. Your supply is pretty good. Your supply is okay. Uh, let's load these guys up. Um, and move them over here. I love that there's a difference between like the thicker three line and the, the smaller three line. This gives you like a good indication of what is and what is not going to provide you any form of protection. Uh, I'm going to move this guy over here. See if we can look into the facility itself. I could probably just bombard it, but I don't really want to waste like a straight on go, so that's what you like to see. Uh, there we go. Uh, these guys can load up and do the same. Okay. Um, Let's see if they have some incoming artillery. See, so yeah, this guy, but this guy is shooting back immediately. Radio incident reports attack with three five platoons involved. Okay. Um, let's see what we're gonna get, right? Let's retreat these BDRs, uh, BR, BRDMs, because it's, it's gonna be not, not any good. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna fast move them over here. Uh, keep pounding that BTR. You keep pounding that BTR. Uh, let's get the helicopters back in. Okay, unload. Ah. You unload. Fighting the uh... oh wow okay yeah definitely a uh, good thing that we got some infantry in here that is uh, Five minutes remaining very good at shooting down helicopters uh, from a very long distance that's a rocket uh, AA is it rocket? yeah Strela is a rocket yeah surface to air missiles. Where are these? These are 
Okay, we've got we are heavily in Fives. Uh, can I get you to start pounding that as well? Let's actually just throw some heavy artillery on that because I think we have this. Okay, these guys can just engage that and you can actually support this. Uh, I'm pretty sure clearing probably has like something. Uh, this route meant to doesn't move in. Veterans are not very good. I'm gonna get these tanks to retreat. Basically, they'll uh, so they can get some ammo. I'll see if these two are f up to the task for resupply, but I think a lot of their infantry is dead. And I don't know if you can resupply that from uh, from here. Uh, T-72 is under attack. Helicopters providing good support. Okay. So that is something I should actually be looking. Out for um, these guys to fast move over there. See what Zone we can find. Uh, I'll set the supply over here. That's probably faster because we're gonna immediately move these over to over there. Um, I'm gonna get these CT some these over there as well. I'm gonna keep this here and the Shulka is probably for defense. Probably better if we put it like that. I'm gonna have you the RT that bit. I think so far I've done pretty good. I'm fairly happy with my. Uh, Results so far. How much ammo do you have? 24. Let's see what they have over here. If it's nothing, right? We can just immediately drive a group in. Then we can remote get the remaining focus on NASA. I don't think tanks can fully dig in. Oh, that's definitely shit there. Yeah, but we can actually make use of the fact that I've got some tanks stored there. I got 20 seconds for another heavy artillery barrage. Okay, I need to retreat these guys up. Got 111 supply left on this guy. Hmm. hmm. That's gotta be a bit far. That is definitely gonna be doable. Not bad. Unless I can get these guys to now over here. Together with this. Um, okay, so this actually replenishes them their riflemen as well. That's very interesting. Okay, I might be able to do it though. We'll send the tanks to the NASA, and I will send the infantry over here. If I smoke up here, before we push over the field, I might be able to approach and just attack it quite directly. We'll use the heavy artillery barrage to just hit NASA. Where's this little scout? Go over here. Fast move over there. Both lost. Oh shit, they're capturing shit behind me. That's not what I would like to see. Hold up, never mind. They might have gone for over here. Hmm. Okay, so your I think my supply truck is officially out of supply. Um, okay, let's. Um, oh no, you should definitely go over here. Uh, T72s. Yeah, fuck it. We'll send them over here. Uh, fast move you over here. Fast move you over there. Yeah, scouting group. One minute remaining. Oh, but there's something else in the back there. That's definitely Estrella. Treat him before he completely fucks it up. Oh yeah, there's a lot in here. That's that group that we were warned about, I think. I thought I uh, fought it off, but that was uh, definitely that group. Fast move over there with an unload. And I want you to fast move over here uh, with an unload at the end as well. We have some supply. We'll smoke this right now. Treat this. Oh shit, the Shilka. Yeah, two Shilkas and a tank crew and a scout. That's uh, a little bit... Uh, 
Let him watch. God damn it, my scouts just keep dying. We just lost vision of that tank crew. Anyway, we've got the uh, after action report. I'm not. I kind of am annoyed that I uh, lost the that last uh, thing, but other than that, I think we've done pretty good. I think we've done pretty good. Is there an exact? Yeah. Well, look at that. We um, we uh, we inflicted a lot more casualties than we took, so I guess that's a good thing. All right. Um, all right. Next phase. I don't know what that contains. Okay. So I guess we're now in the. Second phase in the attack. Phase two. All right, I've got a lot of operational integrity. That's because we, you know, the, the things we captured. I could definitely use this one. So as this one, and let's upgrade our our points as well as our supplies because we've been pushing pushing that through pretty severely. Uh, oh, we also might need to restore units. Um, hmm. Let's see, discard the changes. Let's first restore what we have, because these have some veterancy that I would like to keep. HQ is nice, but it's not the be all end all. But I do actually want that HQ. Uh, yeah, let's call them in. Uh, definitely restore the house helicopters. 100 something points remaining. Uh, a little bit more deployment points to make it a little bit easier to get it, you know. We, you know, what we can in the end of the field. Tactical support more often. Mm, that, I haven't been using that as often as I should have, so. Let's, uh, for now, let's go. Yeah. Oh, we actually have to do this. Okay, 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 okay. Um, I think we can do this now. Because I got the extra points and I don't have that much extra shit on the field. So I think I can pull this in now. I think it's going to be a four phase fight then. The objective is probably going to change. So let's see received. what we have. No, it's still the. S oh, interesting. So it's still the same fight that we had. Uh, this is going to be really expensive, but I do definitely want them in immediately. And there are some forward elements now settled in our points. That's good. So this can actually retreat over here. Uh, that smoke is shit. Okay, I need you to advance on this and this and this. Heavy artillery. We dropped upon that. We don't have our SU airstrikes though. That was maybe not the smartest thing. Shook is going to um, hit these guys. So yeah, this is like reinforced now. Um, okay, so I didn't need to actually capture it all in phase one. So I think we've overdone it a little bit in the first phase, if you ask me. The artillery is helping though. Yeah, these guys definitely needed to retreat because that was a bit, a bit suicidal from my end. You guys are panicked. That is not good. These BDRs need to die soon. Attacks with two to four platoons are involved. I need to dig in a little bit more around this ridge line here. Uh, can you hit this? No. Shit. Can you hit this? Nope. Uh, but that will be fine. That will be fine. Yeah, we're gonna retreat. No, we don't need to retreat these guys. Pull them in here. Uh, send the helicopters over there. I'm gonna. You're gonna capture that. And I can also attack from that angle. So that's what's gonna be making it a little bit more difficult. So I need to definitely get that scout somewhere over here. And eventually, we just need to dig in in Naza, farm, and growth. And. Uh, I think we'll be okay. Uh, let's, for now, retreat a little bit. I don't think ch the clearing is going to be attacked at all. Might be able to dig in something right there, but for now. We're going to retreat the tanks, though. 
kind of want to, I want to get the third tank in. That's basically the reason for it. Um, Zone captured. Good. These guys are still fully fine, aren't they? Yeah, just missing ammo. Roger. There's something over here. Let's see what we can find. We might be able to, you know. So it's gonna be a three to four phase fight. I can just take my time a little bit digging in in here, take the brunt, defend the positions, and then take this in the last of uh, day. I got a lot of attacks coming in according to my intel. I'm kind of worried about that. Uh, actually, I need you guys over here. Um, Rovers captured. Let's retreat those out. Uh, and we'll dig these guys in for now. I don't still know exactly what fast move does. If it kind of ignores firing, so they just speed up or something. That's what it did in. Uh, I've mostly played played Steel Division, so my knowledge is a little bit. Enemy identified. All right, where's that? Okay, it's right there. I was kind of afraid that that would be the attack point. Okay, but those are guys that are getting fucked completely. Okay, but we have incoming from there. I'm getting my splat. I'm not that happy about that. I can see it coming from there. Okay, there we go. Um, hit that. Heavy artillery. I think last time they might have just gone past here. Oh my god, that's a pretty big attack. Um, I need these guys to dig in like that, unload there. They, they can't hold that at all. Holy shit, that's pretty bad. Oh god, no, 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 just retreat. Just get them all out of there. Just give them some smoke support, I guess. Um, that is, that's dealt with. Uh, no, that's not dealt with. Stay here, stay here, stay here, stay here. Okay, they're chucking smoke grenades. Okay, that seems to be dealt with now. You guys just unload, dig in. Get these helicopters reinforced. Uh, did we lose one? No, we did not lose one. Uh, these guys are dug in, luckily enough. So we can... If we move over here, we might be able to hit those tanks in the side. These helicopters are completely durable again. We should be okay. What is the... What are you doing? Oh, fuck, you're out of supply. Um, okay, you got 21% ammo. That's not a whole lot. Shit. Okay, now I'm gonna just retreat these to the start zone. This is the only way we can replenish the supplies. I'm not in cover, and they're already panicked, so... And we are... In heavy cover. I think that's all the attacks that we saw. Nope, that's another four. I don't know if it's gonna be possible for me to grab uh, Naza. Okay, hit the shield there. Facilities being captured. Yeah. Can't really deal with that shit right now. I got 50 points in reserve, and I want to definitely use that for these lads. And I do want to get those tanks back as well, so yeah. That gives me so basically a supply truck. coming from that end. Yeah, the only thing is Grove wasn't defended, of course. Yeah, airspace tonight. That's kind of annoying, because now I don't want to deal with the... Uh... Okay, we definitely need to go over here. Oh, shit. Fast 
don't know what that is though. It looks like, like uh, vehicles. Uh, shit, these guys need to be tricked. I don't want to lose my art. Ah, I got only one, one vehicle left. Heavy attack incoming. Let's smoke up. Oh god, we got heavy attacks coming in from all ends. Uh, if they're coming in from that end, I think I can probably just move these guys fastly over here. Yeah, digging in is not my strong suit. I should have checked if there was uh, the option of deploying uh, like stuff beforehand, like engineering and stuff. I don't think it was. Get the shoot us out of there. It's just gonna be a waste if they die. Uh, let's see if we can fast move them up there. That will load them up. No, it won't load them up. Okay. Fast move. Fast move. We got artillery. We can drop. Mm. Let's wait for them to engage. There we go. Uh, let's get these guys in cover, though. Okay, that guy retreated. Hit that. That. This guy is like in the zone. This is what it's going to get. Let's watch from here. Where are my helicopters? Okay, they're right here and they're fully resupplied. Good. Like this is my quick response force basically, and I can get my. I don't know about your red though. Like, seriously, why is that? Oh, unit is remaining two. Okay. Shit. Um, but I do want my artillery back. Sent that in there. Uh, Shuka is not that original. Guards taken care of. Um, let's send the tanks up there with the supply truck incoming. Should be incoming. Yeah, it's slow, but <sighs> crap. Let's retreat them out for now. I'm gonna just chuck a random arty strike. Nah, fuck. I probably shouldn't do that. Right, I want to get these guys over here. I want to get an eye on NASA. See what he, what I can find there, at least. Before I sent in anything that can be, you know, heavily damaged. Ah, uh, we'll do a quick scoot with the helicopters. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, is these, uh, was it these guys, like, here? Is it these guys over here? Uh, yeah, they're three for three, so this is mostly gonna need, uh, resupply. Okay, so far I've got nothing. Hmm. Oh. Two vehicles. Oh god. Yeah, look. Uh, let's see what it is. Wait. Oh, but I got something over here as well. No, I can... I can loop around here and just hit it from the back. We got a lot of fire here. Oop. Let's keep an eye on that. We have got some air defense, so I probably should want to stay a little bit further backwards. Stuff that I'm really afraid about. Like, where do these attacks gonna originate from? That's gonna be the, the, the big question. Okay, let me just smoke that up so that they move a little bit closer. Okay, so this guy over here. They got some a lot of artillery coming from back here that I can't really do anything about. 
definitely to already strike that. Okay, so really low on ammo. Since these are fast, I'll probably should send them always back to the uh, point there. Let's get these Sani's in because they're going to be useful defending this place. I bet it's about all I can deploy for now because the helicopters are so dumbass expensive. Uh, let's see if I can. I still want to capture NASA though, so it's going to be a uh, must be got an attempt at least. So. I don't know if these guys are range. Cover? Experience in forest, yeah, okay, so there's Let's go smoke those guys. Found that immediately. Okay, these guys are resupplied, so let's send them to the forest as well. Oh shit. Wait, what? They haven't seen me yet, it looks like. Okay, okay. Um, here, where are my air helicopters? They're still moving, I guess. Oh, they are. Yeah, okay. Let's pick them up. That's That's bad. Well, we we destroyed the. Wait, no, these guys didn't lose a tank. I think they were already at two to begin with. Uh, 30% of ammo. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna send these guys and load them up. Fast move them over there. There we go, got another group down. These guys are also low on ammo. We're gonna fast move them over here. I don't know what they're firing at, but they're apparently spotting something in there that I'm not seeing, though, but, uh... Hit that. Uh, let's see, helicopters. They are resupplying. Yeah, these guys are still good, these guys are still good. Yeah, it looks so far looking pretty good actually. Pretty happy with uh, what we're having so far. I'm really, I'm, I'm genuinely really digging this game. I think I've, I'm having a lot of fun with it so far. Uh, right, these guys are resupplying. These mortars are still moving up. We're probably gonna keep moving them so we can hit the uh, hit that. The range is it's gonna be a little bit slow, but before we hit the range. Right. Oh crap! So for some reason we started firing. I think I'm just gonna, ah fuck that smoke is a little bit too close. I'm probably just engage myself in smoke. Shit. Retreat, uh, retreats, keep the front towards it, but just, you know, cover the retreat. We know where these guys are, so that's not the issue. Um, hit that. Um, fast move from the front. Five minutes remaining. Yeah, let's see if we can capture another point before those five minutes finish. I think if we come in from this angle, we can ignore these guys here. Got it. Let's check out. Good fire. A little bit closer. Okay, this guy's got some firing. He's in range. Can I have you bombard that same spot as last time again? Because I'm 100% sure those guys are still alive. Keep, you know, poking a little bit for There we go. There they spot it again. Welcome. And there we go. Tank should be able to see him easily. Yep, there we go. Let's get these guys in the back road here. And 
and from there we're gonna cross them through the field and go in. Uh, I've only been showing this from like really far away, but I kind of want to take a second here to see like these, this game is beautiful. Like these are really good looking models. Like the terrain looks really well. Like this is a this is a pr amazingly looking game. Four rooms and ammo left. It's fairly decent. Let's uh, advance these on the road here. Let's keep getting closer. Those guys might be dead though. Like, seriously. We mortared them to shit. Oh yeah, we did. Okay, capture this. I want this team to go here, dig in. Uh, these tanks for now can go over here. Uh, we can't capture with uh, helicopters, I assume. Let's uh, get this out of our ass then, because that's gonna be. Wait, did we get rid of this? No. Missile barrage in there. There you go. Put panic on him. The missiles in there. Destroyed. All right. Let's uh. Loop these uh, guys back, fast move back home. Uh, yeah. So you're technically still alright, yeah, okay. So, uh, unload. Just dig in. Yeah, look at that. I think we are in uh, pretty good Zone shape. Captured. Total nice. domination achieved. Total domination achieved. Hell yeah. I like the sound of that. Oh, and that just ends it. Okay. Interesting. Um, I guess we have between these is our like the total. Yeah, we've been we've been harassing them fairly well. Nice. Alright, moving on to stage two. Operation state it saved. Okay. Um Okay, so that was this bit. Alright, I think uh Holy shit, this is just, wow, this hold on. Is this like separate mini campaigns then? Okay, so phase three, we get into the next one. Oh, holy shit. I think these are all like separate mini campaigns or like part of the same big campaign, but you can treat them as in sing as in like small campaigns. Okay. Um, yeah, but that I'm actually gonna thank you guys for watching. See you over the next one. I'm gonna continue this. I'm really enjoying it. There's a link to the uh, this is gonna release August the 16th. Uh, 2022, in case you're watching these really late for some reason, or really early. Um, link will be in the description and a pinned comment on top to the Steam Store page. Uh, if you like what you see and if you're in games like uh, like Warno and uh, Steel Division and all that kind of stuff, definitely consider just picking these up. In certain regards, it's a little bit simpler. In other regards, I think it has a little bit more flavor and remember this is developed by 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 a very very small team i think most of it still has been done by one guy so with that said i want to thank you for watching so hopefully the next one have a very good day bye bye